Hey everybody, how you guys doing? Of course, this is JD Olson with Sifu Ed Stahl here at the Martial Arts Limited Association YouTube channel. And so what I have a question for Ed is uh, there's a trapping drill that we do that has the sut sow in it. Yes. And then it switches to something else. Yeah. And I wanted to have you show it to me. Okay. And then also I want to talk about like how in the world is this applied in combat, I guess. Yeah. Well, so first of all, it's an attribute building thing. But this, it's a Siung Pak, so Siung Pak means double pop. Like Siung Jut is double jut, Siung Tan is double Tan. So this is essentially uh, Siung Pak, which is double slap. So if I'm here, it's gonna go slap, slap there. He'll sut out and chop me in the neck, right? Right, I don't wanna get chopped in the neck, so I stop it, and then I double pop yet again, and then this is the drill. So let's just flow for a second here. It's a cool drill, but this stinks because he's slapping me on the inside of my arm and that's not like a, a super conditioned part of your arm. So I want to do the switch. The switch, the one I like, is the toy sal. So I go toy sal, sut sal. And now he's on the, uh, on the outside with the shun box. I slap on the inside and then chop. And then I get him, I get the sting on the inside. But I have conditioned my arms so it doesn't bother me. Oh, okay, good. Because <laughs> uh, that is important. Okay, so that's the first switch. He goes, that's it. And then that's the switch. Okay? The next one is pivot, like that. So. Oh, I do feel a difference, but I don't remember what we did. So I just went with it. The first one, right, is this toy sow and the sup sow. And this next one is as I'm here, I keep ah. this connection here, there's the turn. And then I get the sot sal here, right? So if he switches, okay, so right there, that's the turn, and then I have to stop it there. Okay, that's it. Good. Good. Okay. Next one is I'll pull in here, and then as soon as it's here, I'll pull and shoot. I got nothing. <laughs> okay. It's almost like a, it kind of builds on itself, but what I like to do with it is I'm trying, I don't to, know what to, do. I'm trying to touch the inside. I, it's, it's a hard thing to do. So when I'm here and he touches, I'll just pull slightly yeah. and then shoot. But how do I? So what do I do now? Nothing. I get a free oh, score. Oh, you get a free score. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I don't understand. Okay, yeah. got it. But normally we don't do that one in the drill. It's just a progression. Um, the way it's originally taught is it starts from inside, and then we go Dutch. That's one. Then he touches here, and then I go two. <laughs> and then he touches, and I go three. That's the end of the, the series. first part, this three. The next one is here, and then I touch here, and then I go on the inside. So here, like that. One more time. Okay, like Jackie Chan, slow down. <laughs> <laughs> one more time, slow. Here, touch. I get the inside. Here, pop. Hawk. Okay. It's cool. I like, I actually, it's my like favorite Jikun, Jikuni Do drill. Jikuni Do. It, it, like, and we'll get to the, the actual application, but when it's, I can just start <laughs> touching in the game that JD and I play, yeah. which is we try to kill each other. <laughs> we try to kill each other at every seminar. Um, so I'll let him get his revenge here. He's Siung Pak's, uh, Siung Pak, double Pak. Bop, bop. That's it. That's number one. Number two is I touch. And then and he, then, <laughs> nope, nope. So I'm here, you do the sung pot, I touch, and then you do the sung pot again. Okay, got Number it. three, no, <laughs> here, that's and it. That's the drill. That's, that's, the, that's the progression. Got it. The flow is the next part, right, where he starts and then he goes, and then I show you the switches. Got it. That was good. Um, and you can add in the, the little traps, the toy sal, and I really like it that toy sow hit. Um, so how to apply this, right? So if we're here and he jabs, I get, and I'll get right into there. The idea here is I'll like that and get that. And I can do dumb arm bar -y stuff, but the idea more so is I'm getting this catch, this little pox out here, one pock, and then I can get the two here and touch. And if it's here and I get that, I can get that and start going into what they call the golden combo. The golden combo? The golden combo. It's from Wing Chun. Okay? So, if he jabs, 
and now I can get that. Or I get to that here, and then I just turn it in, mm -hmm. and then I'll wipe, top wipe. Mm -hmm. The golden combo is the three hits. Like from the number seven dummy form, I think it is. Okay. Where you bop, bop, bop. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I work, that's the one I think I'm working the most right now. Okay. So if you, uh, let's switch to the right leg, and he goes in here, and then I get that. Yes, that's when I can go here, or when I'm, that's it. That's it, here, and then I can start scoring there. <laughs> so it's a reach, but I can do that. Now, okay. making that a little more applicable, that double putt, double punch, let's do it from this angle. So they can see here, there, is if he touches it because he knows it's coming. Yeah. Assume he doesn't. That could be right there. This could be the eye. It could be the eye. It could be the throat. Whatever you want it to be, it could be that double hit. It's my best angle. Okay. When he jabs here. Your best angle? <laughs> is here. So when he's going, I can get that hit there. And then if he touches on the inside, most likely I'm not going to have time to do a complex trap. That one, yeah. But if I coming. train it here, here, and then I could just go anyway. I talk about this in my complex trapping video on my channel. Yes, sir. But, you know. Metro Lina martial arts. Metrolina. Metrolina. <laughs> but that's the idea with it. So, when you, when you throw, like, the jab is probably the hardest one. Yeah. Right? But if you throw the cross here, that's way that's, easier. Yeah, trackable. And then now, let's switch back. He throws the jab cross in, but rightly. Yeah, he throws here. It's here, now I can sink in. And now I have at least a collar tie. I don't think I'll do anything with this. I'll probably let that go. Swing that way, turn me in here. Well, does that make sense? Does that help? It does, yeah. Yeah. The, the, <clears throat> again, like I said, this Xiong Pak is, it's my favorite probably attribute building drill that Jeet Kune Do has, but it's probably not super applicable in like a kickboxing thing but it might be more applicable in like a grappling situation. So you did a video a few weeks ago with Icy Mike where you're sparring with him and Sensei Seth or whatever. Yes. And so you don't use this in any of that. You're doing more toy style the whole time? I do toy style the whole time. All the time. Yeah. So the toy style setup is similar, right? Is I'll sit here and I'll touch. So it looks very similar and has that in it, right? If I do Xiong Pak here and you touch, I use that, okay. that particular part. That might be why I'm so adept at it is because I've done the attribute building so long that, you know, if I'm here and I, he punches, boom, I can get it there, or here, boom, jump cross, boom, boom. that's it, sorry. But that's the idea where I can get that there because it's, it's, it's a multifaceted move because I'm attacked by drawing. He wants to throw that cross right. and I want him to, so it's here. So when he does, I don't even have to, boom, right? As opposed to, right, trying to do more traditional kind of outside scoopy things or, or, or here, right? I can get that. But see, that's the, that's right. the thing. And that's, I touched the beard that yeah, time. Yeah, <laughs> And so I'm better here getting the it off. Awesome. Yeah, yeah, where I can touch and go like that. But that's, that's the idea. Cool. So, yeah. Awesome. Thanks, sir. Yeah, no worries. Well, thanks for watching, guys. You know, you made to the video. Please do me a favor, hit that like button if you liked the video. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button while Ed makes funny things in the background. <laughs> and stay tuned to the channel for other videos. We'll see you next time. Bye.